precious flag. Oh, She's no. ruining it. Okay, we start now. Yeah, or well, we've started. Oh, hello, <laughs> YouTube. Well, we'll start again. <laughs> Take two. Hi, YouTube. Today I'm with my friend Sean. Friend, just friends. friends. <laughs> And we're going to be doing like a challenge because of the ice bucket challenge, but we don't have ice or a bucket or a challenge. So we're going to try things that the other person's culture hasn't allowed us to try. For example, Vegemite is the Australian equivalent of this challenge, and the American is... Bubble gum! I, I, I'm going to teach him how to blow bubbles like a girl. I've never had bubble gum, and if you can believe it, Kelsey's never tried Vegemite. Yeah, so let's do this. This is um, the Australian way, I guess, right? Yes. Yes, I'm doing like classic Australian Vegemite on bread. It better be good. <laughs> Just a little bit of butter. I won't like do the whole thing because you probably won't want to finish the whole thing. No, no, it'll, it'll be good. Okay. Maybe Vegemite is yeast extract, whatever that means. Extract of yeast. It, yeah, it tastes like it. Ah, can smells I smell like home. It? Let me smell uh, it. No, you can't okay. smell it. It'll ruin the challenge. Okay, I'm unwrapping the really girly, croppy, kiwi flavor. Kiwi. Oh my god, the Hello Kitty store. <laughs> so it's not really American. <laughs> bubble gum's as American as apple pie. In fact, in some apple pies, there's bubble gum inside. So I've heard. Oh, <laughs> I heard wrong. I'll give you veggie money if you Here's give me bubble gum. Some bubble gum. Do I just like take it out and put it yeah, in my mouth? Just put the it whole in thing? Mouth. Yeah. Or do I the whole thing? Yeah, just the whole thing. No. Just chew it. Yeah, you can't blow it. You, you need a good it's amount. It's huge. Of, you need a good amount of gum to blow bubbles. Half can I put in? Yeah, just. Yeah. And if you can't blow a bubble, you need more. I'll put more in, okay. Yeah. And I just. Just chew it. Okay. Here's veggie mite. I think I'm losing on this deal. Um, yeah, eat it like it's a piece of bread. Mm. What does it taste like? Goodness. I like it. It's really salty. It's like a yeasty. Yes. It's like bread, <laughs> concentrated bread with salt. I'll let you read the it looks like It looks like something you'd find under like a car tire. It's kind of gross looking, but it's really good. Like A car tire? Like gunk you would find under your car. Well, I'm enjoying the bubble gum much more than the gunk underneath the tire will. Um, <laughs> it tastes kind of like... So you have minties here? What's that? <laughs> it's like a lolly. Okay. A lollies. piece of candy? Piece of candy. He means candy. I guess they call lollies. Uh, lolly. It's not lollipops. It's, it's just not just candy. me, it's the whole other rest of the Are world. You're gonna blow a bubble. Blow a bubble. Yeah. I'll, just, I'll eat more toast. Um. Well, read the ingredients while I chew. Okay, here's the container. Jar. It's a container. It's a veggie mite jar. And it has. Yeast extract, salt, mineral salt, salt <laughs> did they mention? Did they mention salt twice? Yeah, there's two salts in here. <laughs> I guess they wanted to be healthy, so they put mineral salt in here too. What's a different kind of salt? Malt extract from barley. Oh. Color. Col coloring? Coloring. We put a U in the word Contains color. Contains preservative 220 U flavors. Nice and diamond, riboflavin, folate. It sounds really Australian made. Oh, it's, it has a little Australian made symbol on here. It's pretty good. If you don't like salt, you shouldn't. You shouldn't use this. Who doesn't like salt, though? I recommend it on bacon. It'll... The human body has salt in it. What? <laughs> when you cry, it's like salty. Oh yeah. I cry often. How do I blow the bubble now? Okay, you go, you like put the gum on your tongue, just like wrap it around, and then you go, mm, and just put air through it. 
you need to chew it more. Like you gotta chew it enough to where the gum is thin enough that it can wrap around your tongue and then you can put air through you can like, mm. it's, hard to, might, it's hard to explain. Vegemite's so much easier. But yeah, I like it. And I've noticed you haven't finished your Vegemite. Oh, I probably should finish it. But it's pretty good. I don't mind it. <laughs> their logo is the best, or they're saying, the best you can be because it has vitamin B in it. Get mm. it? It's funny and tasty. It might be really bad without butter, so I recommend the butter on here. And the toast, this is like whole wheat. It might be better on white bread. I prefer white, so. Are you ready to blow your bubble yet? I'll try. Should I wrap it around my tongue? Yeah, you gotta wrap it around your tongue. Mm hmm. And then, and then put air through it. Like, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> oh, fail. I think we need better gum. Like, this is just like Hello Kitty story gum. We, um, probably like Bubblicious, something like very American would work better. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Kind of. Here's this crap bubble. No, that's gross. That's fit. Oh. Well, I failed, but Vegemite was a success. Yeah. Which was what I was kind of hoping. In fact, I kind of skewed the um, competition by pretending I don't know how to blow bubbles with bubble gum. It's very salty. It's a weird colour too. Oh, black's good. It's the colour of night. Dumb. Oh, I don't think you can mix Vegemite with bubble gum. You mm. shouldn't mix, mix cultures either. Shouldn't date other cultures either. It's weird. <laughs> okay. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you're still with us. Bye. <laughs> Did you just swallow it? You're not allowed to swallow it. Um. No, because it'll stay in your gut for seven years. Seven years. That's like when you break a mirror. Yeah, and... What if you break a mirror like, and then it makes you swallow the gum? Which happens first, the curse of the broken shattered glass or the curse of swallowing bubble gum? You have to do both at once to cut it. it. It'll to cancel, cancel each yeah, other out. You, know. you have a mirror? Um, you could put the one in the bathroom. That might work. Oh, I have like uh, a... What's it called when you swap gum via a kiss? It's called ABC gum. ABC gum? Yeah. Oh, there's an episode of Animaniacs. I think they do like ABC gum. It's in one of those old cartoons and they make like a joke about it. Like it's cool or something, which is really gross. I won't do that then.